What's up? It's Jared from Vandalistica Vlogs, and I'm at Sunny Bay, um, town, I guess you call it. See, so, yeah, no, this is where I come and do groceries and that kind of stuff, and I was really just leaving the house to get some cigarettes, but I thought I might just weigh in on all this talk that's been happening lately about red flag laws and toughening gun laws and trying to put in new gun laws, and um. I'm sure it's been said elsewhere, but the thing that I don't understand about that is gun laws, any kind of law really, to be honest, any kind of law doesn't really prevent anybody from doing something. Um, if you want to commit some kind of crime, then, you know, you just kind of make the choice to forget about personal responsibility and then you go and do that. The law doesn't stop you from committing a crime, it just, uh, it means that there's some kind of penalty for having done that thing. So it doesn't really matter how many new laws or, or how many laws there are currently on the books, it doesn't stop people from committing crimes. And the uh, thought that you're going to like stop these mass shootings, mass murders, or any kind of gun crime. Do you think you're gonna reduce the amount of gun deaths in Chicago by any significant amount by adding new gun laws? You just obviously haven't thought about what you've said before you said it. Um, I wish there was something that could be done to kind of reduce just kind of like senseless violence in the world but the problem isn't any kind of tool so the problem isn't guns or knives or compound bows or anything else that you could do harm with the problem is that there's no There's, there's nothing that you can do to stop people from making their own choices and kind of deciding that they're gonna let personal responsibility go out the window. Um, there's some people that are gonna just decide to put themselves in their way but while being ahead of others. Oh, it's way too bright in here. I actually had to go back and watch the last bit of that um, video because I went and got groceries. Actually look at this drink I got. Where is it? This drink is... The only reason I got this is because of how blue it is. It's ridiculous. It looks like drain cleaner or something. Actually, let me just have some right now. Whoa! <laughs> I wasn't expecting it to be that sweet. It's like, um... I don't even know what that flavor is. Just sugar and water and blue. When people are talking about, oh, we need to do something, somebody needs to do something, I feel like the, the thing that um, a lot of people in the gun channels community, in the gun tubers, um, and the um, people who create gun content on YouTube, I think a lot of you guys are doing exactly what needs to be done, and that is the, the clear and concise um, teaching of just straight up facts and um, and kind of destigmatizing um, firearms ownership and you know what it means to support the second and um, yeah I mean I'll say this like a lot of people aren't the biggest fans of um, uh, Eric and Chad or Eric and not Barry as I've <laughs> as I've called them sometimes, but um, but you can't deny what they're what they're doing in terms of education and um, you know just constantly putting out content that does really I don't think it does anything to hurt us. I think it does everything in the world to um, to promote uh, responsible gun ownership and um, yeah, so. That's where I'm at with this. I mean, people asking what it is that we 
what can we do to try and prevent these things. And I think education is key because that's that's the only reason why people are going after guns is because they're it's an uneducated view and stance on what the situation is and it's misguided. You can't subtract a tool from the equation um, and not take into account the the you know the actions or the mindset of the bad actor. It always comes down to a bad actor, regardless of the tool. So yeah, anyway, that's my two cents. It's night time now and there's a lot of cars and birds chirping, so <laughs> I'm gonna sign off here. But anyway, God bless, look after each other, keep fighting the good fight, and we will see you in the next one. Bye.